let us see how to create a Google Calendar event on submission of a Google Form. I have a Google Form here which is called Consultancy Request Form. It takes input as name, email and when do they want the consultancy, the location at which they want and some more information in terms of the detailed requirements and some attachments. Once this form is submitted, I want a Google Calendar event to be created in my calendar here with the information that has been submitted here and I also want an invite to be sent out to the person who is submitting this form as well as to myself. So to do this, let us open a add-on called form director. Let's choose the app called Google Calendar inside form director. The service is create event. Let me choose a calendar. The calendar is called consultancy request calendar. This is where I want the event to be created. By default, it takes the, the local time zone as the default single time zone. I will leave it there. So whenever uh, request is submitted, I want my email to be notified with the invite. I want to get the event invitation, so I'll mention it here. I want the color of the event to be blue. Let's look at some advanced services. I want a conference to be created. I want some reminders. I want a notification 30 minutes prior to the meeting. And I want an email, let's say one hour prior to the meeting. Once I have done this configuration, I will need to map the form fields to the calendar fields. Form director automatically identified six fields that are directly mapping. So let's go ahead. So these are the fields which are mapped directly because the names are same uh, between the form field and the calendar field. So start date, start time, end date, end time, location, attachments are mapped directly. So let us see what is not mapped. The title is not mapped. The title of event, I want it to be saying that consultancy meeting with, I can put a dynamic form field here saying that with the name name of the person who is submitting this form. I'll save it. Then let me see what else is missing. I have the description. The description has to say, I want the description to be taken from the requirements. And the guests, the attendees basically, to be taken from email. So basically I want uh, myself to be notified as a static email here and whoever is submitting, they also should be added as an attendee in the invite. So we have now mapped all the fields that are required for calendar event. Let's save. Beyond this calendar setting, we can send a email notification on submission of this form. So this email will go on successful event creation. We can go through the, the template for it. Let's say by default it comes as form director and then let's say I want it to be sending to vacation.jurus.com.
I'll just give some information in the mail. I can put the name. Let me put uh, the email. Right. I will enter that. Let me save the service. Once the service is saved, it is going to appear here. So now we are good to go and submit this form. Let's say a person called Ajit comes here. He enters his email ID. And when does when does the consultancy required? Let's say on first July start time ten AM. The end date same as 1st July, I'll say 11, 11 a.m. We want to, he wants to end the consultancy and let's choose video conferencing. The requirement is to discuss business opportunities. He, let's say he's going to attach a file. and submit the form. Once the form is submitted, you will see that the calendar event should be coming up here. So it has come up here. If you open, you can see that the guests are Ajit who has given his email ID and Myself, I have given the static email ID there and the title of the event is Consultancy Meeting with Ajit. The name this is picked up dynamically and the details are mapped here. The attachment is coming here. You can also notice that the conference is set up and the remainders are set up. We can also see a calendar invite is sent to me as a email. This is coming from the Google Calendar so that I can accept it or I can say no or whatever the response that I can say. The similar uh, invite will go to Ajit also because if you see that it is, it is sent to myself and Ajit. Then I email notification from form director based on the template that we have set up that is also sent. So it's that simple to create Google Calendar event from a Google form submission. Thank you.